uh, you talked at the very beginning about how we're in a fiscal crisis where people are making their decisions about what they do based on what their confidence level is in this economy. Is there anything in this package, as far as we understand it, in the Senate um, or the House bill that you think will really address the fiscal crisis that states are facing all across the country? Well, yes, there's a lot of money for state and local governments quite deliberately. I mean, some of it's in the form of Medicaid, which could be easily fungible. So Medicaid's a jointly funded federal state program. If we put more money into the federal side, then states can use money elsewhere. There's also a stable, state stabilization fund to help them get through this tough period. So it is quite deliberately designed to make more money available to state governments so that they're able to get through what is likely to be a very very difficult stretch for the is next two years. Is there anything you'd like to see in it that isn't in it, apart from just more money? Well, as I said, we really have a chance to transform the economy. I was mentioning health care. We have a chance to get very quickly to national health care insurance. We can't get a fully designed program, but we can cover just about everyone in, in a matter of months. We have the money to do it. The other thing we can do, as I said, shortening our, our work years, work weeks. We're way behind the rest of the world. Everyone else has four or five weeks a year of guaranteed vacation. Many countries have 36-hour work weeks. Everyone has paid parental leave. We're way behind the rest of the world in these areas, and we could just jumpstart that tomorrow. So if we're prepared to think big, this is an enormous opportunity to turn a crisis into something very positive for the economy and society. Crisis and opportunity. Finding, final thoughts. Teresa, you know, um, I think a lot of people are hearing about the multiplier. And so you keep on asking, is the dollar of spending in these various places um, the same? And the answer is no. If you spend money on tax cuts, you're going to get a small multiplier because people are going to save it or they're going to spend it for goods overseas. If you put money towards state and local government with Medicaid, well, you don't um, get... Um, treatment for asthma in Thailand. Mm. You know, so a dollar for state and local spending has a larger multiplier than a dollar of tax cuts. Those are really the polls.